Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to a brand new vlog. I am sat on the floor. You may notice or recognize that this is definitely not our house. We are away for the weekend. Um, we are headed off to Disney Springs for the day, which is super exciting. I'm just sat down getting ready. So I figured we'd chit chat, do our makeup together. This video is very kindly sponsored by Charlotte Tilbury, which is literally the dream come true. She has come together with her brand with Disney to celebrate 100 years of Disney magic and 10 years of Charlotte Tilbury, the brand, which is just amazing and I cannot believe I am sitting here today working with her and her brand. It's just absolutely incredible. And before we dive into these products, I have a few that have been staples in my routine for a very long time but they have also given me a link to share with you guys if you are interested in any of these products the link will be in the description box below to check them out and we are going to get ready today using the beautiful charlotte tilbury times disney products the products that i have are inspired by cinderella i have found my new all-time favorite blush so also fun fact this is the first launch that charlotte tilbury has done with disney and these products have launched july 31st so they are available for you to get your hands on oh my gosh we have tinkerbell on here it is so cute the gold zipper and then we have the charlotte tilbury logo on the back but guys this product i have had for the longest time ever this is the hollywood flawless filter for a superstar youth glow and they mean it like this is the most incredible you just look so refreshed and dewy like it's just that look that everybody goes towards or goes for and i'm sure you guys have seen this product around um it's viral it's hard to get and you can probably tell this is not my shade. Um, when I purchased this, this was the only shade they had that was closest to my shade. I am in a lighter shade, but this, I was like, oh, I don't know if this is gonna work. But this, if you go a little deeper than your skin tone, gives you that summer golden goddess glow. This is in the shade 4.5 medium. And what I do with it is I literally just put it all over my skin like this, which I already have done after I put on the amazing magic cream, which is so hydrating, so incredible and goes flawless under your makeup. Here, I'll put some up here. Let me grab my brush. I'm back. So I just take it in and I literally just kind of like buff it into the skin with a brush you can use a damp beauty blender if you want i just find that going in with the brush just just works for me so that's what i do again i don't know if you can see like that nice beautiful glow from within that it gives but it's just incredible okay so next we're gonna talk about blush do you see this this is this is almost gone like i have flown through this product a little goes a very long way but i am obsessed like obsessed with this blush if you were to buy one blush forever this would be it it gives you that beautiful glow this is the beauty light wand easy highlight blush and it's in the shade i think it's just pink pink beauty light wand so what you do is you just pop the top off you twist the product to open it. I don't know if you can see that there, but you just twist here and you literally just dot it on. There's still product off, left over for me so I didn't have to like squeeze the tube, but I love putting this on my nose right there. And then we just blend this out. You can use your fingers. It blends seamlessly like that. You can use a brush. I always go in with a brush and then I'm just gonna kind of like pounce and blend the product in and it is so stunning like it is oh my gosh it is a winner for sure and then next i have two highlights from them i have the beauty light one easy highlight in gold and then i have the beauty light one easy highlight in spotlight spotlight is my go-to it's a bit lighter and then the gold is literally like this beautiful gold undertone so i'm going to go in with spotlight again you squeeze a little bit to the tip and you're already really dewy and glowy from that blush highlight combo but this just adds a bit more and who doesn't love a bit more and then i put it on the tip of my nose a little on the bridge and a little on the cupid's bow do you see this it's on another level so yes the plans after this guys we are it is a beautiful day florida has been super hot and sunny and then we had like this spout of rain 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 and today it is not supposed to rain we are supposed to have beautiful sunny weather so i figured let's go to disney springs i think that would be really fun we can check out what they have they might have fall goodies out already which would be so awesome um so we'll see we'll see what they have 
do you just see this amazing like effortless skin like dewy that is what charlotte tilbury is and this cute line with disney is just the best ever this is the luxury palette that's the amazing thing too about charlotte tilbury is their products are luxury but they are affordable they apply easily like anybody can use them in my opinion they are so like if you're not great at makeup hi me um they're just amazing to use they're effortless and they are beautiful on any skin type so here is the eyeshadow palette that i have I am obsessed with these two colors. They are stunning. And these are great for like a smoky look and a liner and stuff. But I primarily pick these two. I'll put this literally all over my lid. And it's just like that really beautiful champagne bright kind of color. And I just use my finger. And then this one is like a not glittery in a bad way but like a sparkle there we go like the disney cinderella sparkle that is what this is so you just pop some of that over top and we're good to go beautiful okay next should we do lips or should we do eyelashes i think we'll do lips okay so they have also sent me their gorgeous brown liner and what i do with this one I don't do much of a wing. I'm very basic. I just kind of do like a cute little flick here. And literally I call it a day. Like that is all I do. Just a little something after that. And so many of you have asked me in the past, like, do you line your lips? What do you use? And I've always, I've never lined my lips. I've never used anything until they sent me this product. And this is like the perfect nude. I literally think it's called nude. Hold on, let me see. It's called Lip Cheat Iconic Nude Lip Liner. Wait until you guys see this. This is a very creamy formula that stays put. It keeps my lips lined all day. And it's amazing. Like you're gonna see how this applies. This is incredible. And it is literally the perfect nude, so. I don't overline because I already have pretty like pouty lips, I think. So I just stay and then like, look at this. Like that's just beautiful. And then we're gonna go, oh, did I ever blend that? I don't know if I did, there we go. I love the highlight on the Cupid's bow and the tip of the nose, it's my favorite. You see the difference on this side versus this side? It's incredible. All right, and that is my lips lined for the day. And I also have Pillow Talk, which this is my second tube of this. Absolutely gorgeous nude. But what I have been doing is not the lipstick. You guys know I am a gloss girl. They have sent me their beautiful gloss in the shade Refresh Rose. So I'll line my lips and then I'll take their gloss, which look at this wand. It's so cute, the shape. Um, and then I just kind of put this on. So this has kind of been my go-to look is the face very simple very subtle glowy from within kind of products with the lip liner and the gloss is a win and then the last product to get ready that i have is their mascara and this is the mascara pillow talk push-up lashes in super black first i am going to curl my lashes and then we are going to pop on the mascara and the mascara just gives you a nice length and volume which is what we all love. And fun fact that I learned, if you're applying your mascara and it transfers to your upper lid, don't panic, don't try and rub it, wait till it dries, take a Q-tip, literally just like swirl the Q-tip and it'll take the mascara right off, it's amazing. All right, so that is the difference. Now we're gonna do the other side. All right guys, and that is the look to get ready with me to head out to Disney Springs. Again, if you guys were to try any products, like, oh, this is so difficult, but if you were to pick two products to give you that beautiful glow, oh my gosh, I don't know. Um, let's see, okay, so you guys know I love this Beauty Light Wand Easy Highlight Blush. This is incredible in shade pink. 
and then i have to say like the flawless filter is just incredible like this duo is insane and i love i also love their highlight i love the lip liner oh it's so hard to pick but if you would like to try any of these products again i do have a link for you guys down below to check out and try and charlotte tilbury oh my gosh what a dream come true thank you so much for supporting my channel and for working with me and it's just incredible let's head out go off to disney springs see what we can get into and just have the most magical time we are walking into Disney Springs. We've just parked the car. We're right outside of Cirque du Soleil, I believe is how it is pronounced. And Disney Springs does not look packed, which is lovely. I think everybody started school, so um, we'll see when we get in there. Plus it's early still, but let's see what we can find inside Disney Springs. Also, Larry's shirt, can we appreciate how cute that is? <laughs> is a very blistering sunny day I do see at the AMC theater. They're playing the Haunted Mansion, which is fun. One day we're gonna ride the hot air balloon. I have spotted Disney style, so we're gonna pop into the store, see what they have. It's $25 a piece, you are going on it. Today? Yes. Do we have to? Yes. $25 a piece? Naturally, I'm terrified of heights, so Larry's trying to get me on the hot air balloon. Guys, this man's taking me on this hot air balloon. I should be like, oh, it's so romantic. No. <laughs> oh, no. What if it deflates? What if it pops? What if a bird's beak penetrates it? All the things that could happen. What if we get a massive earthquake? Oh, God. We're up in the air. Look at this. I guess we're riding. Okay, so we are next in line to go on the hot air balloon. It is a 10 minute wait and like a 10 minute ride. So we'll be up in 10 minutes. They're trying to take off on this flight right here. Oh, my gosh. Heaven forbid that little cable. <laughs> Just stop talking, Mindy. <laughs> stop talking. <laughs> Y'all come this way. Okay, you're oh my. <laughs> Y'all have a good day. Right this way. Welcome. Go ahead. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, Thank you. have a nice day. Y'all oh have a good one. Oh my. Everybody, welcome. My name is Mike, and we are about to feel a little bit of motion. You guys hang on. No, I don't mind. All right, everybody, hold on to one of those handrails. We got some motion here at the beginning. Here we go, everybody. Oh, Jesus. Take the wheel. Oh, dear. We are all. Yes, it is. Got lucky. All right, then we're gonna feel a little bump here. We're gonna to come to a stop in just a quick moment. Here we are. And now we will continue the rest of the play with this time. We are going quick. And we got one more little bump right here. All right, it is no longer necessary for us to hold on. If you feel comfortable, you can walk God. around. Down below us here oh on the platform, God. there's a giant compass rose that'll help us get our bearings. <gasps> and all the Disney theme parks are going to be out to the west. And if we're looking Which out here west. on the horizon, we can start seeing the bigger attractions. <laughs> oh, I think I see Tower of Terror, Larry. Maybe. Y'all have any questions? There? Oh, go, Jesus. Right? Oh, my God. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. We're going to oh. stop about 250. 250. Oh, my word.
guys, we made it. We're back on land. And thank you, Larry, for taking me up there. You're Thanks welcome. for making me do it. I am one of those people, though, guys, that once you're up, like once I'm up really high, I cannot move. I cannot breathe. I, well, I can breathe because I'm still breathing here, but <laughs> but um, yeah, I don't move. Larry's like walking around the hot air balloon to the other side. And then did you notice? Oh, picture, pictures, I'm gonna dang it, pictures. Um, everybody started to come to our side of the balloon and I could feel the balloon tilting the one way. Did you notice it? Yeah. I'm like, oh God, please don't flip us. <laughs> oh, yes. uh, I think I'm still lightheaded, headed. I'm, so, oh my gosh. I am still lightheaded from that endeavor. But continuing on to Disney Springs to see what we can find. Lots of restaurants. My highlight is on point. I know it is. I can see it. That's drama. You look marvelous. <laughs> Thank you. Simply marvelous. Thank you. Ooh, cakes. Cookies, cakes, and other curiosities. at Disney Springs with the spring behind me, I was pregnant with Liam. <gasps> oh, little man, and it's right next to this T-Rex restaurant. I believe it's a restaurant, which also reminds me of Liam because he loves dinosaurs, but how beautiful is this view? We are working our way to the World Disney Store. I can see it. Larry's behind me somewhere. He always tells me to keep walking. He always stops and he's like, keep going. I'm like, okay. So he catches up. <gasps> I see Halloween. This is so cute. It reminds me of the 90s. I love that. They had it in a sweatshirt. I would get one. That looks like the 80s. And Larry's like, this is the 80s. <laughs> That's so fun. I am blurring the background here because it is very, very crowded. There is a lot of people in here and I'm trying not to film any kids. Um, but I do see the Happy Halloween Disney section. So we're going to run over to there, take a peek at what they have this year. Look at the little Halloween Disney princess dresses. This is so cute. Oh my gosh. Look at the pumpkins. The bat. The bats. Price tag. $54.99. It's not bad. Not bad. It's soft. Focus, focus. Do they have any throwback to the 90s? That's what I need. <laughs> the shopping portion of Disney Spring. They have all sorts of things. So we're just gonna kind of check out which stores they have. 
All right, guys, I spotted Sephora. I'm gonna pop in and see if they have any more of the Charlotte Tilbury products. The flawless filter. Oh, this looks beautiful. Now you can see the Charlotte Tilbury flawless filter outside working its magic. This is what it looks like on the skin in the sun. Such a beautiful glow. It was so fun to peek inside the store and see all of the Charlotte Tilbury products. And Larry did the most amazing thing, which makes me nervous. I do not have the guts to ask this, but he asked if I could sit in the chair that says Charlotte Tilbury on the back, and they let me sit in the chair. So got a picture in the chair, which was really fun. They, have, they have a full <laughs> staff in that area. They have product, they're doing um, sample stuff, and they were very knowledgeable. I don't know that much about it, so it, to me it seemed like they were extremely knowledgeable, and I'm sure they were. They were, and they were very, very nice, but makes me so nervous to ask and do those things, but. If it was appropriate to dive into this fountain, I totally would. But it's so warm. Heading into the Disney Candy Cauldron. You guys know I have to get a caramel apple, right? <sighs> hey, got my two chopped nut caramel apples. Larry got a Coke. Making our way back to the car after a gorgeous day at Disney Springs. We're gonna head back to the hotel hop in the pool, unwind, and relax for the rest of the evening. I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me today and getting ready with me today using the beautiful Charlotte Tilbury products. Remember, if you guys are interested in purchasing any of them, everything will be linked in the description box for you. And thank you so much for spending your time with me, and I'll see you guys again in the next vlog. Bye! I ate my loaf. Yeah, that's your loaf. I didn't? Take my Thanks, babe. Oh my gosh. Oh. Um. Mm hmm. That loud noise is rather inconvenient. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Good morning, everybody. That sounded weird. <clears throat> you guys, oh, this is a bad idea. Do not use your viewfinder to do a wing. Oh, no, no, no. Absolutely not. Okay, here we go. So, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where did I put the lid? There it is. <laughs>